saw was uh, a semi-traditional um, example of teaching, what's called talim. The way that this repertoire is propagated is not written down on uh, sheet music like um, in the Western tradition. It's, it's memorized by people who um, practice it, polish it, and then teach it orally, just like this. So there wasn't a thing like, why are you making these guys pick this up by ear? Why not just give them the sheet music? There's no sheet music. You can write it down, but that's not where, that's not how you learn it. You just forget it. Yeah, yeah, unless you hear it. So that's the main thing. To be more specific and more mundane about it, this was a class. This was the last meeting of the music, uh, what is it, E23, right? Which is the Music of India Ensemble. Um, they're all getting one credit for this class. We meet once a week. Uh, we do this thing when we sit on the floor on carpets. Um, we practice um, some fixed material, and then we accumulate uh, new improvised pieces that I sort of compose for them. And then at the end of the semester, we play a concert, and then we never play that piece again. <laughs> well, that thing that we composed is just for the purposes of, uh, of one semester. tell them that they have to practice hard. That is the only secret. And practice the movement of the hands correctly. Therein lies the secret. There is no other secret. The more they practice, the better they will do.